How's it going, everybody? Robin here. Welcome to my channel, Aries Fire Tarot. I am doing your daily tarot card reading, and I have to look at the date because I never know what day it is. This is going to be for Thursday, July 22nd, and the deck I use for Thursdays is an Oracle card deck. This is the Butterfly Oracle. Okay, um, so I'm going to pull a card from this deck and one from the Angels and Ancestors because I've been using this deck all week as sort of an anchor card. So... I've been thinking it's time for me to get a new tattoo and I was looking last night at designs and I was thinking of getting a butterfly. So thoughts, opinions, I was thinking of getting it in pink and purple and I'm kind of wondering if the card that I'm going to pull for you guys will match the color scheme that I'm seeing. Um, how would that be for alchemy, right? So let me just pull a card here from the butterfly oracle card deck. Nope. <laughs> welcome to the new. And of course, I start hearing welcome to the jungle. Thank you very much. Um, what band is that? Guns and Roses. I'm not even a huge fan of theirs. But anyway, um, I'm going to pull an angel and oracle card deck. And however, they've been on the radio constantly. Every time I drive my car, it's some sort of Guns and Roses song. And I'm like, no thanks. I'm sure you're very talented, but uh, they're not for me. So this card is summer. Bask in joy and light. So we've got some sort of a stinging insect here. So this is really beautiful when we pair these together. Bask in joy and light. And then this says welcome in the new. Okay, so we saw yesterday how you could really... Use your own experiences to bring healing to yourself. And I gave you guys a little bit of a recommendation on how to do that with kind of interviewing yourself on a video recording and not watching it right away. So I'm not even going to go on a pause and look for the page here. So this says, welcome to the new. Change can be exciting, bringing you opportunities for joy, learning, and success. This card indicates that you may have been anxious in the face of newness. And, you know, change can be very challenging. Um, so I get it. You are reassured, though, that this change will bring many blessings for everyone involved. Although it may occur differently than how you would have scripted it, all is in divine and perfect order. Have faith that you'll know what to do in each moment. Trust that your needs will be provided for every step of the way as long as you follow your inner guidance. Allow yourself to be to feel excited about this change and approach it with a spirit of adventure. Additional meanings is a big positive change. Respecting the free will choices of everyone involved, even if they differ from your own. <clears throat> Taking an adventure trip, going on a holiday, and trying something completely different. Okay, so is it summer mostly everywhere? Like it's like a, a ridiculously hot summer where I live right now. So this is a really good time to try something new if you can. Our restrictions are just lifting here. It's been a long, tough haul with this COVID, you know. So I imagine as soon as everybody's able to, you might want to start traveling again. You might want to go on an adventure. Enjoy your summer a little bit, you know. Um, does everybody have that? I guess everybody has to do that, right? Um, there is some sort of privilege granted to people that have a double immunization. And for here, we're going to have to print a card and carry it with us because people that are vaccinated get a different level of access than people that are not vaccinated. So I find that very interesting. You can, guys can let me know if that is happening in your corner of the world. So like for me... I can't wait to do something like our lockdown was so strict. It just really kept everybody inside and unavailable and stagnant. And, you know, this is also a really good opportunity to work on your spiritual growth. But like I see people in other locations where you're opened up already. Um, 
you know, and, and congregating and doing fun stuff. So if you are able to get out and do something new, um, like try it, you know, just go for it. Enjoy your summer here with this card, summer, breathe in joy and light. There's nothing, I, I love the feeling of sun on my skin. I love to sit in the warmth. I love to do uh, sun gazing in the morning, in the evening. It's a great time to go W-A-L-K-I-N-G with my D-O-G. <laughs> you know, it's just so much more enjoyable to me than any other time of year. And something that I wanted to talk about quickly with the welcome the new Respect the free will choices of everyone involved, even if they differ from your own. So not everybody's going to be on the same page as you, obviously. Um, <clears throat> it's like some people just want to sit at home and that's okay. I think if that happens, if you want to do something, if you've got a more of an adventurous side and you stopped inviting somebody because they always said no, like, I just want to talk about that quickly because sometimes people have social anxiety or just an overall anxiety <clears throat> and they need a couple more requests. Like some people need to be asked multiple times, hey, are you sure you don't want to go? Or is there something in the plan that we could change to accommodate you? Um, you might want to consider the budget of other people. Not everybody has the same expense, uh, like... What, a, what do you call that? Disposable income. So maybe you want, want to try doing something like a picnic instead of a glamorous lunch. Not all the time, but something a little bit more accommodating for other people, especially people with social anxiety. I actually have really bad social anxiety. So um, you might want to offer to pick somebody up if they don't have a vehicle. Just try to include other people, even if they're saying no to you, even if they have a different opinion of what should be happening with welcoming in the new and enjoying your summer. So there are some tips and tricks, you know, to helping everybody get out there and really enjoying um, society once again on the same page. Okay, I'm going to go. Love and light, guys. Bye.